the three stanzas that were chosen to be placed in the prayer for Yom Atzma'ut, which can be found on page 917 in the Koran Sidor, reflect aspects that we should be thinking about when it comes to Medina Yisrael on Yom Atzma'ut. The first one, which is chosen, is Hit Ori, Hit Ori, that speaks about light. For your light has come, rise, shine. There's so much light that it's that emerges from Eretz Yisrael, we should be grateful for. The, we're building up the country. We're slowly building up Yerushalayim, which is a lot of blessing and light. We have so much Torah being taught there, so much religiosity, so much creativity, so much culture is being spread from Medina Yisrael. All that is the spiritual light. And that stanza speaks about that. We have, we have to be grateful for that. The next stanza speaks about the physical redemption. It speaks about the shelter that Medina Israel provides. In you, the needy of my people shall find shelter. We're so we're so lucky and we're so we're so grateful that Medina Israel is around, especially for those in the diaspora. There's a safe haven for us. If if all of the anti Semitism that is happening now uh, was as rampant as it was and, when the, and as it is now, without a Medina. Am Yisrael would be in great trouble. We'd be back where we were for 2,000 years of exile, being chased and persecuted. Thank God we have a safe haven. Thank God we have a backbone in Medina Yisrael. But it goes beyond that. <coughs> it says, The city shall be rebuilt on its hill. On its hill. Medina Yisrael is being rebuilt. All the prophecies are coming true when it comes to rebuilding the land. We have a government. We have an economy. We have an army. We have so many good aspects of a nation we aren't just a religion we're a nation and all the components of that are now being built up in the most beautiful way so i want to thank hashem for that for the high tech for all the goodness that medina israel has on a spiritual and a physical level we're thinking about that the final stanza is yaminu small tifrotzi that hashem taritzi then it speaks about right and left you shall spread out you shall revere god through the descendant of parrots we shall rejoice and we shall be glad this is speaking about the future, future redemption, which is about when a Mashiach comes. Bezrat Hashem, that should come soon. We're, we're praying for that and hoping for that. We need to recognize all the blessings along the way. The first few stanzas of, of the Chadodi were omitted, perhaps intentionally. Mikdash melech ir melucha kumitzimi tocha Emerge from within the destruction. Well, we have emerged from within destruction. We need to give thanks for that. Similarly, you know, rise up from amidst the dust. We have Baruch Hashem, Am Yisrael's risen up. After two, the, the bones have been brought back to life, we are planted in our country and we are growing, we are flourishing, and we need to give thanks to Hashem for that. So those are some of the gratitude points we're thinking about, we should be thinking about on